Good afternoon and welcome to Cal Plays on Crosswalking Kobolds. My name is Cal and today we're going to be playing some Pokemon Legends Arceus. Uh, just continuing our playthrough of the game. Uh, this is the furthest I've made it in the game. So uh, yeah, here we are. We're, 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 we're making progress. More progress than I have in this game ever. <laughs> Um, let's see here. Uh, I do want to go ahead and thank KTH92 for following. I don't know if they're still there, but thank you very much for following. I do appreciate that. And, uh, I suppose let's go ahead and get started, right? Let's see, so if we go into the water... Mm, there we go. Um, so B to dash. And Y to jump. Okay. Not a huge fan of this control scheme. Oh, well, no, guess that's not going to work, huh? Why am I hearing alpha music? I'm not dealing with an alpha. Okay, there's a cave here. I wonder if this cave is where I'm supposed to go. Let's take a look. Okay, so the cave is a bypass to this area. And this island is where I need to go. Here we are. I'm a little concerned the sound effects are a touch too loud, so let me just go ahead and lower it a little bit there. There we go. Okay. Um, let's just go ahead and do one of these real quick. Okay, cutscene. <clears throat> Whew, Fire Spit Island. It's certainly hot enough to feel like a sweat bath, isn't it? And now we've got a ghost and bandits to deal with on top of the heat? I'm very sorry, but do you think you could lead the way, Cal? Yes, yes I do! That poor Grelith. I don't dare imagine what those bandits are doing to him now. Okay, so we need to go on ahead. Which we can do. That, 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 that's not a problem. Probably, right? Okay. Ooh. Lava flow. Oh, um... Well, I guess we'll fight him. Right? Oh, he's only level 34. We're fine. Ooh, there's a swallow in chat if anybody wants it. Uh, let's see here. Exclamation mark. Poke. Oops. Uh, poke. Shop. Poke. Ball. And then exclamation mark. Poke. Catch. Let's see if I get it. All right. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and do a rock smash again. Okay, good. I was worried with the iron defense it wouldn't do enough damage. Okay. And we'll grab that as well. Oops, wrong button. Hmm. Let's also get this. Oh no, it's a Graveler! Level 34, what will we ever do? Rock Smash! <clears throat> Excuse me. He does an Iron Defense, good, good. And we go ahead and we do a rock smash again. Ooh, he got a hit on me. We'll rock smash, it's fine. We've got him. OK. 
Okay. Ooh. Some of my Badoo can evolve. Let's go. All right. Uh, that's, uh, right? No. It's up. There we go. All right. So we'll go ahead and we'll evolve these Badoos. And we have a Roselia. And we'll grab this Badoo too. Awesome. Ah, let's go. Alright, and let's also get a potion on him. What's he missing? 172 health? Uh, I guess we'll give him a hyper potion. Here we go. Oh, hey! I'll take that. Sweet. But there's nowhere else to go up here, so... I guess we're supposed to go this way. Aw, oh, the swallow escaped. Ah, right, I need to get off my mount. Magmar! Magmar! Uh, let's go ahead and throw a great ball. There we go. Magmar caught. See if we can get this one without being noticed. Nope. Nope, we can't. You are very lucky, sir. You have one chance, one chance alone to join my military. Do you accept my offer? Yes, yes he does. Awesome. Okay. Oh, he's looking this way. Wait till he looks the other way. Oh, he saw me. Okay. throw a great ball see what we get uh, see if we can get him if we don't get him in one throw I'll just take him out sweet let's go all right Okay, let's go. Um, Rock Smash, Flamethrower, Infernal Parade, or Swift. Um, let's go with Infernal Parade. Ah. Barely touched me, bruh. Okay, Magmar down. Uh, we're gonna have to fight this one. Alright, let's see if we can catch it, though, because I don't think I have Magby yet. Uh, never mind. This is where it would be nice to have that, uh, those, uh, smoke bombs, I guess. Because there's not really any cover here. So I'd have to make some cover. Ooh, hello. Uh, 
there they are. The Sisters of Misfortune. Uh, let's go ahead and heal Tyrosian up to full here. Uh, let's see. He needs about 50 points of health, so we'll just give him a regular potion. Cool. And let's go handle these three. <clears throat> Come on! Evolve already! We've done our homework. Any Pokemon gutsy enough to come to this lava trap is supposed to evolve. So get on with it already. You will become stronger, like it or not. Growl. Oh, look, the pest again. Stand back, sisters. I'll take care of her. Go, Obama Snow. Smash this fool to pieces. The Obama Snow's the wrong choice. Yeah, I get it. But Obama Snow's the wrong po wrong choice. I don't know if I've done all my strong style um, flamethrowers yet or not. Or strong style attacks, I should say. I should look into that. I don't get it. How'd I lose? You know, Obama Snow can't fight at full power in crazy heat like this. It wasn't a fair battle. We're basically going easy on you. How dare you make poor Obama Snow battle in such a stupidly hot place? You're the one who sent out Obama Snow, sister. Go on then, Toxicroak. Pour so out some poison for our unwelcome guest. Okay, so Toxicroak. Should be easy enough, right? Excuse me, especially since we're level 46. Hmm. Let's do a strong style flamethrower. And he's down. Nice. Let's go. With a blithering moon calf, uh, what a blithering moon calf I am! How could I let myself lose? I guess I lose the coin toss sometimes. That wasn't a coin toss. I did warn you, didn't I, that I had a score to settle with Galaxy Team? All the pain and suffering I experienced after coming up here from Kanto Region to work. I'm going to make you pay for every last slight. Okay, sure. This is actually the scariest battle, but as long as I go first, I'll be fine. 30... Oh, right on. Ooh, that's a bit different than I was expecting. Hmm. I may regret this, but let's do a rock smash. Don't do a rock move. Ah, you did a rock move. I said don't do that. It's fine. I lived. Let's go ahead and do another rock smash. <gasps> oh, no. Shoot. Okay, okay. Tyrosian, come back. Come back, Tyrosian. I'll take care of you after this battle. Um, Roselia, uh, go. Uh, go ahead and do a strong style absorb. Oh, I should have done agile style just in case there's another. Oh, there is another Pokemon. Is it the Gengar? 
Yep, it's the Gengar. Oof. Oof. Okay, okay, it's fine, it's fine. We'll try the other Roselia. Uh, let's do another strong style absorb. Ooh, that was not enough. Hypnosis, huh? Okay. Um, I guess let's pull out another Badoo. And, um, let's go ahead and use our Max Revive. Do lived. Interesting. Um, in that case, uh, let's do the only thing that'll be effective. Let's see if we can get a stun spore in. Okay. I guess these are just not very effective, so. Target has a status condition. Let's go. Uh, not quite enough. Ooh, but he's paralyzed and can't move. Let's go ahead and do a regular style Vanishock. All right, let's go. We got that, Gengar. What a disgrace. How could all of us have been? Hey, Charm! I healed up a, a bomb of snow, and Toxicroak's, uh, and Coin's Toxicroak is good as new! Now we can keep battling until we run out of potions! Bow! What? Hey, no one invited you, Tiny! You're really going to insist on getting in the way? Uh, I'm getting in the way, you little runt. Take him down, Toxicroak. I know it's hot, but hang in there, Obama Snow. Smash that runt. Growlithe, please stop. You cannot beat such foes. P Polina, what are you doing here? I thought you were waiting with little Growlithe. I was, but he jumped into the ocean without warning and swam all the way here. Into the ocean? But he was terrified of the ocean after it swallowed up the former lord. His own father. Roar. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. He's accepting the mantle. Accepting the mantle of the Lord. He is an Arcanine. Looks like he finally found his courage. The late Lord's child, he's evolved. His true bravery lay not in crossing the sea, but in finding strength to face hardship head on. You gotta be ch kidding me! Why'd the puny something or other? Uh, sisters, something's not right. Ooh.
Nice. Good moment for sure. What? What? Polina, stay back. What's happened to him? That strange lightning hit him. He's become frenzies, just like the other nobles. Oh, <clears throat> oh, this is exactly why I didn't want to come to this island. Is it now? Is it? Is this exactly what you thought was going to happen? Ugh, everything was going just as we'd wanted before that awful mutt ruined everything. Enough of this, sisters. We leave this place. We won't be making a any living with our uh, without our lives. Bye. Hey, wait. This is all your fault. We should get out of here too, Polina. Otherwise, we're fair game, fair game for the Arcanine. Come on, Cal. We should hurry. Lena. What are you going to do about Corellis? I mean, Arcanine. That dear little Pokemon is my responsibility. As Warden, it is my duty to protect him. With everything I have. Cal, what m must we do to quell his frenzy? Please, tell us what we need. Balls. We need balls. I mean, balms. Yes, balms. We need to make some balms. Balms? Arita, what are you talking about? I'm the leader of our clan. I'm the leader of our clan. Is it so surprising that I know a little more of these things than you, Lena? I held my tongue the first time, but now I must insist. Stop calling me Lena in front of everyone. And yes, I'm well aware you're the leader, Arita. How could I forget that you were the one chosen? You, who can use your Celestia, uh, Celestica flute to summon Pokemon and have them carry you even uh, to even the farthest reaches of Vast Hisui. I've learned a little about these frenzies as well. There's a special method for dealing with them. We can make balms! Pouches containing a mix of the Lord's favorite food and throw them from a safe distance. Isn't that right, Cal? Well, uh, in that case, I do always carry some of Gralis' foods with me so I can thank him when he uses his flames to help. Prepare Basculagon's favorite meal. Why, Iskon, once again, your thoughtfulness saves the day. Now we can make those bombs right away. Yes, let's get right to work. And what do we got? They're ready. Uh, they're ready. Here are the bombs we need. Please let me know when you feel prepared to try to quell Lord Arcanine's frenzy. All right. So. Now we've got another uh, Lord to fight. Uh, we've only got one Pokemon that's viable for the fight. Uh, my other Pokemon are Grass Pokemon. Um, and I can't really change that. So, I, I didn't mean to roll forward. I'm sorry. Um, I meant to open my bag, but I forgot I wasn't playing Pokemon Scarlet. Thank you. Um, okay, so you're at 184. Should be good enough. Um, what do you know from moves that will deal with fire Pokemon? Um, oops. Change moves. Uh, do, 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 do. Really? No ground moves? No rock moves? Alright, I mean, I, I guess, I guess we go in with, uh, probably Infernal Parade. I, I don't see... Let's see, 60, 60. Doubles if they have a status condition. 
You have rest, but that gives me a status condition, not them. Hmm. Okay. All right. Let's move forward with what we have then. Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. Hopefully, Arcanine doesn't know bite. Actually, hopefully I don't have to fight him. Be on your card. The late Lord Arcanine would launch devastating attacks after standing still and gathering light around himself. Remember uh, that while you're dodging, moves will slip right by you. Good luck. Okay. Lord of the Isles, Arcanine. Let's go. Okay. Ah! I needed to roll there. Oh, shoot. Invisible wall. Come on. There we go. I guess I didn't roll right. Hmm. Yes, I know. Thank you. Oof. Is that it? We gonna have to try again? Might have to try again. That's okay. Everything went black. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and give it another shot. Go ahead and restart the battle. We'll get this. We'll get this. No problems. You'll see. You'll see. Come on. Oof. Come on. I didn't press Y in time. Oh, I pressed Y too early, I guess. Ah, come on, I'm pressing Y. Come on, go down, go down, go down. Damn it. Okay, we'll try again. Sigh. We got further than last time, though. <sighs> yes, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm aware. Hit him with as many bombs as you can during this phase. Stop his attack in his tracks. Yeah, we got that. Got that one figured out. Thank you. All right. What I haven't got figured out is the timing on the dodge. Yes, restart the battle. Let's go. Uh, what? 
Okay. Okay. That's my fat fingers for you. Oh, come on. Tried to get too many shots in that time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. All right. And down to half health. Let's go. Oof. Oh, I dodged the wrong way. Oh, that was stupid. I should have dodged forward. Ah, oh, we got him down below half. Well below half, though. We're getting there. We're getting there. Yes, yes, that was the same tooltip you gave me last time. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and restart the battle. All right, let's go. Missed it. God damn it. Come on. Damn. That one's hard to get the timing on. Okay. Damn. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. I hate that leap. Oof. Um, okay. He jumped. Um, he jumped immediately after with no time. Okay. All right, let's try again. Let's go. We can get this. I believe in us. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's go. Oops. Ah, I didn't quite get the timing right on that one. Ah, I didn't dodge. I thought I was going to be outside the range of his dodge. Oh, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Screw this. Let's go. Let's go! All right. Um, I'm going to fight and do Infernal Parade. Ooh, snowball in chat if anybody wants it. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, not so great. Ugh. No! Ugh. Oh, that looks scary. Oh! I needed to dodge. I didn't see the glint in his eye. Okay, okay. So I think we can use the islands to help us pr avoid the jumps. So one of the big things that's catching me up is the jump where he does the AoE blast at the end. Um, I think what I need to do is just stay on the little side islands and just dodge from side to side. Because I think when I do that, he will only charge me. I think. I don't think he'll leap to the side islands. Okay.
Because it's really hard to dodge that leap for me. Damn. Okay. Okay. Good. Got him below half. Got it. Okay. Oh. Um. Okay, I think we got him. I think we got him. Depends on how long he stays here, but I think we got him. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, we got him. Whew, that was hard. Okay. All right, let's go. Ah, uh, missed the snubble, though. Whew. All right. Arcanine's back to his usual self. Thank you, Jetagon! <laughs> hey, welcome to the chat! How's it going? <sighs> Alright. Oh, look! The strange light has left Arcanine and is vanishing into the space time rift. <sighs> My heart's going about a thousand miles an hour now. Adrenaline pumping. And we got the flame plate. Let's go. What could possibly lie on the other side of the rift, I wonder? Grr. Doing great. Just got back from the gym and saw you were on. Yeah! Yep. I'm still going. Um, 6 p.m. Eastern to 8 p.m. Eastern. Yeah, that's how time works. Um, all right. What? Was that two different Arcanine cries just now? Oh, it's the ghost of his daddy. Oh, now I understand. My little Growlithe. Uh, no, I misspoke. Lord of the Isles, Arcanine. You and I must now live apart so that we may attend to our separate duties. Rawr. Now, now, all will be well. You're strong. Far stronger than me, in fact. Ghost of his daddy. Yep. <laughs> Rawr. From now on, let us each strive to fulfill our duties as Lord and Warden. Now go, Lord Arcanine. Your realm awaits. Alright. I need to quickly grab another water. I will be just a moment. And I will be right back. Please don't go anywhere. I won't be long. I promise.
See, I told you I wouldn't be long. I try not to leave during stream at all, but I needed a, a beverage real quick, so. All right, let's see here. Oh, how odd. I certainly didn't. Please. I, oh, hey, my be back soon sign is still up. Let's get rid of that. Please, I do hope you're joking. I'm easily scared as it is. What am I to do if I start hearing the cries of ghosts all the time? No need to worry, Iskin. I only kid. I also heard the voice of the previous lord calling out to us. It seems I wasn't the only one watching over his young pup this whole time. Cal, you have my heartfelt thanks for helping my dear little one, the new Lord Arcanine. I'm sorry to ask even more of you, but please look after Irida as well. Nod. Now then, Iskan, I believe we'd best be off. Nod. Just nod. Okay. Cal! I wasn't... Uh, I wasn't much use just watching from the side, was I? You know, when Leon would, uh, wouldn't raise Gal uh, Growlith to be the new lord, and people in our clan were doubting her fitness as warden, I urged her to put Growlith through proper training, but she snapped at me. This poor Pokemon saw his own father die, she told me. It's a warden's... A, uh, is it a warden's duty to force a child in such pain through that training? Those... Those words left me with much to consider. And even when Arcanine became Lord of the Isles and grew frenzied, all I could do was watch. What about the bombs? Please... All I did was arrive late and help explain about the bombs. Something you could have done without me. No, I'm a silent protagonist. I can't do that. Is that so praiseworthy? Do I deserve to be recognized for such a slight contribution? I took on the leadership of Pearl Clan, so young, with no grand vision for what it should be. Still, I tried to respect her old customs and sights. Even as some called me old-fashioned for it. But watching you, I finally see. I know what I want to do. I want to protect this vast land of Hisui. Grant me another battle someday, Cal. I want to battle alongside my partner, so we can grow strong enough to be of help to you, and to broaden the horizons of the world I see. Yay! Pokemon battles solving all the problems! Looks like I've got Leon to thank for yet another lesson that I've learned. I should let her know. And, uh, and hear more about her relationship with Warden Iskon while I'm at it. Here's where we part ways for now, Cal. I need to get off this oven of an island. Okay, bye! Okay, so now we need to report to Commander Kamado. Uh, let's go ahead and get on our mount. Actually, before I go down, I'm kind of curious. Is there anything over here that I care about? Like, I don't even see any spawns. Hmm. I can't go in the lava. Fighting solves problems. I, 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 it solves some problems. Sometimes it solves bullies. It, it's not the recommended first step, though. Okay. Ooh, let's see if we can get a Magby. Do I have whatever it takes to create smoke bombs? I've never used them before. Um. Oh yeah, this is the workstation right here. Okay, cool. No, I don't have the stuff for stealth spray or a smoke bomb. Uh, okay. Well, let's see if we can sneak up on a Magby. Get in that Pokeball. Yes! Alright. Graveler, can I have you too? Is 
that a catch? It is. Okay, good, good. Um, let's see. I think I'm just going to run through the rest of this. I got a couple of magmars, and, and honestly, I don't really need more. So let's just kind of... Oh, wait, hold on a second. <laughs> I just remembered. I can fast travel. Just need to get to a point where things aren't staring at me. There we go. Wrong button. Let's try that again. All right. Yes. Fast travel me. And let's see. Here we go. We've caught 24 Pokemon. Care to report your findings? And there we go. There's our findings. 24 Pokemon caught. 15 different species. 12 of them were the first time I caught them. 16 were backstrike. That's over half. And then I caught three alpha Pokemon? I don't... I don't remember catching three alpha Pokemon. That was last week. <laughs> um, all right. Let's go see. Yep, we made some new observations, too. For sure. Hey, let's go. 69. Nice. Let me just go ahead and screenshot that. <laughs> all right. Uh, let's see here. You quelled the new uh, Lord Arcanine? Oh, let's tell Commander Kamado uh, the good news. Well, let me try that sentence again. Let's tell Commander Kamado the good news then, shall we? Back to Jubilife we go. Nice. Yep. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, hello, you've got a side quest. Hello again. Wonderful timing as always, I see. You really came to my rescue with the pickling stone, you know? You're, uh, you're quite the little helper. So I wonder if I could impose on you again for help with the new pickle proposal of mine. Uh, I was down by the sea gathering fresh ingredients recently, when, wouldn't you know it, an octillery popped up and sprayed me with ink. But the, uh, but the thing, the ink, well, it actually tasted rather good. Inspiration quite literally struck me at that moment. I knew I could use this ink to create pickles the likes of which the world has never seen. But making food out of something a Pokemon has spat up seems risky to say the least, no? Uh, so a little research on Octillery is in order, I think. That's where you come in, dear. If you learn more about Octillery, please let me know. Okay, will do. Thank you. Hey, what do you got? Anything good? Joltik and chat if anybody wants it. I'm gonna see if my Feather Ball will catch it. Okay, catch. Feather Ball. There we go. We'll see if that worked or not. Hi there! We've got some great stock at the moment. Here's all the goods I've got right now. Anything catch your eye? No. No. None of that looks good to me. I'm good for now. Okay. Bye. Moving on. Ah, the ice cream stand guy wants something. Hey, how do you get Pokemon to be your friend? Hey, no, no, not you. Him. Now, before you buy a wee treat, lend me your ear a moment, uh, would you, lass? I came up with a new treat using candy truffles, but it's caused me nothing but sorrow. Every last person who tries it says it's beyond saving. It's a complete disaster, utterly terrible. I've had to shelve this new creation, and there it remains in a salty puddle of my bitter, bitter tears. It'll likely never see the light of day again. It seems like I'll never be able to pull a, uh, pull a profit from my creation, but I'd like to at least share my recipe with someone, lest it be forgotten entirely. Uh, you like making things with your own hands, don't you? Could I share my recipe with you? I've got plenty of candy truffles to spare, but you'll need to bring soft root and springy mushroom and a hoppo berry. Got that? Do I have that? No. 
No, I don't. I don't got that. Okay. Let's hit up the farm real quick. Way over here. Okay. And hello! Yes, you're done gathering my harvest. I don't even remember what harvest I planted. Castor fern leaves, plump beans, sand radishes. Must have been a vegetable garden. Uh, so we'll do a mushroom garden this time. Sounds great. Okay. Let's get back to the HQ. And report. Uh, hold on. We've actually got one more side quest over here. Let's go grab that real quick. And then we'll go to Kamado. And come on. Way over here, huh? Oh yeah, there it is. Hi! Hey, I hear you're quite the Pokemon expert. I was wondering, do you know anything about a Pokemon that has two fin uh that has two tail fins? What? A Pokemon that has two tail fins. Can't say that I do. I saw one swimming along the other day, fluttering its two fins behind it. It looked so lovely. It was captivating right away. I really want to see that Pokemon again, but this time I'd like to get a good look at it up close. So if you catch a Pokemon with two tail fins, please come to, uh, show it to me. Okay. For sure. Um, and now we're going to go on the main quest here. And enter. Do, do. Yes, I would like you to teach me. 1400 gods, okay. I do not have enough for the next tier, whatever it is. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye, good sir. And let's stop here. Taste of honey. Yep. Okay. And... Hi. Oh, not quite enough to get to the next level. Okay. Alright, let's head up the stairs then. And up the stairs again. You did well on your mission in the Cobalt Coastlands. Your efforts there aided not only the Galaxy Team, but the Pearl Clan as well. I do hope your efforts will also have an impact on the space-time rift somehow. If we're able to get rid of that rift, it should clear any lingering doubts about your origins. Though... How we might actually close the rift, I haven't the slightest idea. Nod. Remain true to the mission. Okay, will do. Uh, if you notice that today's potato mochi tastes a little different, well, that's because I used a Pokemon's flames to roast them. Bon appetit! The birth of a new Lord Pokemon. What a sight that must have been. If only I had journeyed to Fire Spit Island to witness the event myself. You could even ride on a... Uh, could you even ride on a Basculagon in the first place, Professor? Come now. You know my coordination is so poor, I couldn't even hit my own feet with a Pokeball. And I can't dodge Pokemon attacks quite literally to save my own skin. 
Of course, I can't possibly ride atop a fearsome beast like Basculagon. That being said... We'd all do well to remember these wise words. The ever-striving soul is rewarded in the end. And I, uh, and strive I shall for the sake of my research. I will surely ride a Pokemon one day and record the experience in our Pokedex for all posterity. Just you watch. Okay. We're eating. The next day. Do 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 Good morning. Uh good morning, good lady, who came from the sky. Commander Kamado told me to let you know he awaits your arrival in his office. That looks like a Diamond Clan person, I think. Cal, I have your next orders. You must go to the Coronet Highlands to quell another frenzied lo noble, Electrode, Lord of the Hollow. Electrode has a propensity to store up electricity in its body, then unleash it. But since Electrode became frenzied, those electrical outbursts have become giant blast. Hmm. We'll be enlisting the Pearl Clan's aid in securing your safe passage to the uh, to Electrode's seat. I've sent word ahead to Arita asking... N no You don't have permission to go up the... Oh, save it. As if I'll be stopped by the likes of you. Now out of my way. Oh, well, I guess strong on the voice. Yep, that was an incorrect guess on my voice. Hey-ho, boss man Kamado. I thought I might have slipped your mind. Uh, it might have slipped your mind to send me an invite. So I took the liberty of stopping by anyway. Mealy, where are your manners? We're having an important conversation. Well, there's your issue right there, Adamant. How exactly do you intend to discuss Electrode? Without me, it's Mighty Warden here to weigh in. There's no more to discuss. We've already asked Cal to quell the Lord of the Hollow. Oh, come on. Is it me you're trying to humiliate? Or our entire clan? Besides... Do you really think this flimsy little noodle can quell Electrode? Commander, I'm sincerely sorry for this. Headless interrupt heedless interruption. Pay it no mind. It no, no? Wrong voice. <clears throat> Pay it no mind. It seems even Security Corps personnel I trained myself cannot stop one so capable as Warden Melee. That being said, yes? It is clear that the Security Corps needs even further rounds of training from me later. Hear that, Melee? Sir, the Security Corps will sob themselves to sleep tonight, thanks to you. The Commander's sumo moves can send even boulders flying. Hmm. <laughs> Now, now, that will do. Cal, you have your orders. See to it that Electrode is quelled. Warden Mei Li, of course we would appreciate your help if there is anything you might assist with. Nod. Nod, nod. Now go. Scaling perilous heights. Okay. So, we're going to get a mount that climbs walls then, maybe? Like Karaidon? That'd be nice. Listen, Melee. The Galaxy Team, well, at least Cal, is amazing and we'll prove it. Follow me outside. Okay, I guess we're going to battle. Let's go. Hold on. New side quest. 
Hey, Mr. Person with a side quest? Sigh. What am I going to do? At this rate, I'll make real uh, make a real fool of myself in front of... Conlon? Who's Conlon? Eh? Oh, hello. You're one of those kids from the Survey Corps, right? Ah, you might actually be just the person I need to help me f uh, out with a little research. My boy Colin, uh, Conlon and I are planning to go to Prelude Beach at night to try to find the ghosts that are rumored to haunt the place. But ghosts scare the daylights out of me. Uh, my son, yep, he's terrified of them. You'd think we could just go and call it a day. We could just not go and call it a day, rather. But no, I'm afraid his little heart set on this. But, er, uh, you know, a fellow can't stay scared of ghosts forever, right? It's just too tragic. For my boy, I mean. So, m maybe if I study up on ghosts, I can find a way to help my boy conquer his fear. If you've got any research on data on spooky Pokemon, Ghastly would be a good one. I'd be mighty grateful if you'd share it with me. I think I do. Do I have this one already? Mushrooms, eh? I'll be. It says here that Ghastly likes to eat mushrooms of all things. Not that that's a bad thing, mind. It's just a lot more tame than I was expecting. And here I was thinking that ghosts love nothing more than to snack on unsuspecting humans. You know, it's funny. I'm actually rather partial to a nice mushroom stew myself. Maybe ghastly aren't so ghastly after all. Hey, Dad! What you doing there? Ack! Colin! Or Conlin! Are you talking about work again? Don't forget, you gotta take a day off tomorrow. You promised you'd take me to see the ghosties at Prelude Beach, remember? Uh, of course, your old dad remembers, kiddo. And I'd never let work get in the way of our ghost hunt. I'm really looking forward to it. Yay! I'm gonna catch a ghostie and show it to all my friends. Bye! You know, he was just putting on a brave face because you were here. Anyway, I owe you one, kid. I get the feeling my boy will be just fine tomorrow. Getting to know ghost. Complete. Hey, we got a linking cord. Nice. We can do a trade evo, then. Alright, Cal. Go around with me. You bet. Let's go. My Tyrosian will t take out anything of yours. Ooh, there's a clay doll in chat if anybody wants it. Let's see if I can remember how to spell Cypher Ball without looking at it. Spell check, can you spell cipher? Let's try that. There we go. Okay, cool. Oh, two on one, is it? Um, okay, uh, let's go ahead and uh, we'll start with a... Regular style flamethrower. On Leafeon. Which is enough. Good. I'm ten le levels higher. I suppose it should be. Baby doll eyes to lower my attack. Okay. Oh, offensive stats. Not just my attack. Okay. Um, and for you, we're going to do a rock smash. You're a much lower level. There we go. Cool. Nice. You see how good Cal is now, yes? No more sneering at her. <laughs> now, I think our helper from the Pearl Clan was going to meet you at the training grounds once you're ready. Till later, Cal. Glad to have your help, as always. 
Melee, shift, your, uh, shift yourself unless you want to get even more of an earful than you're already due for. Aw, come on, Adam. Cut me some slack here. Cal! Oh. Join me in the security car office. We'll go over the particulars of your new mission. Okay. Whatever you say. Yes, ma'am. On the double. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Oh. Your survey work... Your survey work will take you to the Coronet Highlands next. You'll be on the Rift's doorstep. There's no telling what perils await. Your current rank qualifies you to conduct research in the Coronet Highlands. But you will need help from a particular person to survive and ultimately quell this electrode. Go to the training grounds. You should find them there. Okay. They're doing a lot of hype up for this person. I hope it's worth the hype. Oops. Bump my mic. Sorry about that. Alright. Ooh. Another side quest. Hi. Hmm. No, that's not quite right. It just needs a little extra something. Oh. Just the girl I need. I could use your help coming up with new hairstyles. I have hit a real wall here. A Pokemon would be a great inspiration, I bet. Right now, I'm picturing... Yeah, mischievous. If I could study a mischievous up close, I'm sure I'd come up with some amazing new styles. If you manage to catch a mischievous, bring it here so I can have a look, okay? Okay, I think I have one. What? Get me that mischievous. Okay, I guess I don't have one. That's, that's, that's fine, too. Um, alright. I hate that I can't bring my mount out here. Oh, I didn't get the clay doll. Hi. Um, I want new moves. On Tyrosian. Mm, bulldoze, ominous min, um, mystical fire. You do have mystical fire. Why can't I grab it? Ah, there we go. Okay, so we'll grab mystical fire. Uh, I've got about one thousand left. Let's grab bulldoze as well. Okay, learn those. That'll give me some good type coverage. Uh, also, the hacks will work well with the parade thingy-majigger. Okay. What else can I do for you? Um, nothing in particular. Well, I'm thinking about it. Uh, let's see here. Oh, most of my grit dust isn't here. It's in the... Oh, hello. Let's use the sun Tyrosian to increase his HP. Yeah, we'll get the rest of it later. Okay. Hello, Cal. This gentleman is Warden Ingo. Uh, he, uh, who serves Sneasler? Sneasler? I don't remember Sneasler. He will guide you to her domain. Pleased to properly meet you. I apologize for that abrupt how-do-you-do do before. I am Warden Ingo. I understand that you need a hand from Sneasler in order to meet Electrode. Whether she'll see fit to help you, however, we can only find out by making the journey. Now, let's have a safe journey to Mount Coronet all aboard! Ingo's a bit like you, you know. Uh, how so? He appeared one day from who knows where. What's more, much of his memory seems to be missing. Maybe with uh, with you, maybe traveling with you will help fill some of the gaps in his memory. Nod, nod. In any case, I'm glad to have your help uh, help to count on once again, Cal. 
Good luck up in the highlands. Thanks. I'm probably gonna need it. Okay, so I think Sneasler might be an alternate evolution for Sneasel. Uh, the cat? Or is it Weevil? Uh, e either way, I think it might be an alternate evolution for that line. I don't know, I don't remember hearing about a Sneasler. Okay, let's start by depositing pretty much everything. And then sort this. And then we'll go over here and sort this. And then let's see here. I'm looking for grit. There's, there it is. Okay, move to satchel. Uh, and move this to the satchel. And then reorganize this. Okay. All right, let's uh, go back over here. And we're going to use this on the only member of my team that I know I'm keeping. And just work to max out his stats. It's not like there's a shortage of this stuff. If I really need to farm it, I can just release a bunch of Pokemon. Okay. And then we're going to use the gravel. And we've already maxed out special attack on gravel. So we'll do HP next. Okay. Uh, let's go for... Uh, speed next. Alright. And let's go for defenses. Um... Start with physical. Okay. And let's deposit this, and I missed depositing this. Okay. Cool. Let's get moving. New zone, new Pokemon, new items on the ground. Should be fun. Let's go to Mount Coronet. Do, 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 do. Hello there, Professor. There you are, my girl. Welcome to the Coronet Highlands. I expect you'll find all sorts of rock, uh, uh, rock type and ground type Pokemon wandering about these craggy, boulder strewn heights. And up there. Right beneath that great rift in space and time is the meek, uh, sorry, is the peak of Mount Coronet itself. The magnetism from it may well exert some sort of influence on Pokemon throughout the area. Uh, fascinating stuff. Okay. Before I proceed, um, let me go ahead. I want to see my Pokemon. All right. So, these guys evolve through stones that I don't have right now. So let's move them back into the vault. Okay. And then let's go back to the first pasture. All right. Um... We can evolve a Scroopy into a Drapion, right? That, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Uh, let's go ahead. Yeah, let's grab a Shinx, too. Oops. There we go. Cool. Okay, let's get started. Get that for me. Thank you. Oh, speaking of Luxray. Huh. Oh, 
Oh shoot, that's what I didn't do. I didn't craft any Pokeballs. Okay. Um, let's see here. That's not the one I... Yes, this is the one I want. Yes, okay. Um, let's bring me back up to 20 of these. Okay, let's get one more leaden ball. I've got 20 of those. Um, let's make another of these. And then another of these. And we're good there. Uh, I've got five revives still. What's this, scatter bag? Okay. All right, cool. Moving on. You saw nothing. Pay no mind to the man behind the grass. Uh oh. I think, I think, I think they might have saw me. Oof. That did more damage than I hoped. Uh. Okay. Um. Stun Spore. No effect. Oh, right. It's an electric Pokemon. Electric Pokemon can't be stunned. I forgot. Um. Okay. Cool. Uh. So, that didn't work so well. Let's go ahead and go in with Tyrosian then. Much better. Okay. Um, had I known I was going to be doing this, I would have used ground moves. I would have had a ground move ready. Um, okay. Uh, 38. Let's go ahead and do a strong style flamethrower. Ah, not quite. But he's burned. Ugh, and we're paralyzed. That's gonna be annoying. I was already paralyzed, dude. Um, let's go for a regular flamethrower, I think. Yeah, cool, cool. Uh, let's head back for a nap. I should have tried to catch those. Why didn't I try to catch those? It seems like the obvious thing to have done. Oh well. I'm a star in chat if anybody wants it. Um, let's see. Poke, shop, great ball. And poke, catch, great ball. All right, what's next? We need to move in this direction. It looks like they respawned. Let's see if we can very sneakily ca uh, creep up. You don't see me! I don't exist! Nope, nope, you still don't see me. I still don't exist. I said I don't exist! Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's try a different uh, attack here. Let's see. 
Oh, hello. Is this a plant? No. These are hardy grains. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Grab some of those. Oh, hello, Mr. Sailor Man. How are you? The electrode known as Lord of the Hollow is somewhat different from the electrode I recall. But its electro electrical discharge, at least, are familiar. One false step around it could put you in danger. If you're going to face it, you might consider catching a Pokemon that can withstand electricity. It must be difficult being a Pokemon, don't you think? Especially one so uh, uh, as irritable as Electrode. Then becoming frenzied to boot. So true. It's a tough old life for Pokemon and humans alike. Oh, it's Melee. Well, well, Warden Ingo of the Pearl Clan and... Oh my! The Galaxy Team grunt from before. You're punching well above your weight to seek out the Great Electrode, Lord of the Hollow. But... By the sheer tenderness of my heart, I'll grant you one trial to see if you're worthy. The greatest obstacle you'll ever face awaits you right here. Battle me if you dare. Sure. Hmm. Well then, tell me... Why didn't I have an option for sure? Let's just fight it. Hmm. Well then, tell me... Let me tell you, rather... Uh, the great Melee's take on this whole situation. The frenzy of our nobles is nothing other than a mark of Almighty Sinnoh's favor and protection. Why? Because it makes them stronger. Do I really need to spell out that that's a good thing? We must let my lord frenzy as it may, to demonstrate to Almighty Sinnoh that the Diamond Clan lives as is right and good. This may even be, dare I say it, the very reason I am here on this earth. What business is it of galaxy teams anyway, if Electrode lets loose a few sparks out here in the mountains? Really, you should do us all a favor and slink back home to that village of yours rather than present this folly. And with that, bon voyage! What a selfish outlook. These frenzies cause Pokemon themselves such suffering. But what is it the uh what is it you want to do, Cal? Press on. Very well. The tracks ahead will be perilous, but I provide I pride myself on safe driving. To meet Sneasler. Cal, you must pass through here, the Wayward Cave. Here you'll find a poke, find Pokémon like Goldbat and their ilk, which are quite at home navigating in the darkness. It's quite dim inside, so you'll need to watch your step. Okay, that's fine. How dim? How dim is dim? Well, this is odd. The torches that light the way through the cave are gone. Could this be Melee attempting to obstruct us? Either way, there's no need for concern. I know my route, and I'll conduct us safely. No darkness nor foul weather will delay us. Onward, we roll! Take care not to come uncoupled from me. I was going to save, but okay. I can re recall faintly that I had a partner once. A precious one. Its name escapes me. But I remember that it wielded flames with mastery. If only it were here, I'm sure it would light the way, luring us. 
Please forgive the unscheduled stop. I detect an Alpha Crobat to our right. Under normal circumstances, I doubt its presence would obstruct someone so competent as you. But given the poor visibility, I propose a track change in interest of safety. Please follow me. Take care not to un come uncoupled from me. I am starting to recall a man who looked like me. We battled. The words, I like winning more than anything, flashed through my mind just now. We'll soon be arriving at Wayward Cave's exit. Even if the memories themselves have faded, it appear much still lives on in my heart. In me heart. Let's go with that. Me heart. This is fine progress. We are nearly home. Pre. Wait. Could those be? Let me put these torches back where they belong. The darkness could be perilous for the next person to pass through here. I beg your pardon for the delay. I have lit and returned the torches. My safety concerns have been addressed. Ready for departure. If you follow the track marked by torches, you'll reach the terminus of this cave. Okay. Sounds good. We're almost out, guys. Oh, I need to push A. Need to push A. Professor Laventon told me how you fell to this land from the sky. For my part, I simply found myself one day here in Hisui, a region whose name I'd never heard. All I could remember was my own name. I was still standing there in bafflement when Pearl Clan came to my aid. I showed a natural affinity for taming Pokemon, which is why I eventually became a warden. But still, I wonder, what is my true purpose? Ah, but now I've sidetracked us with this talk. Let us hurry onward. Yes, because time is the most important thing, because because Sino is Lord of Time, right? Right, that, that's, that's, that's the line? That's what we're, we're, we're supposed to be going with? Try that again. Ooh. <gasps> a shaking tree. It's a shaking tree. Oh, it's a hair across. I mean, I'll catch a Heracross. I don't think I have one yet. I was really hoping for a Cheerum, though. Ooh. Badoo, I need to get you out of there first and foremost. Um, let's get Tyrosian in. Sword Stance. Really? Okay, items. Uh, let's go ahead and give him one invitation. You have one invitation, Heracross. Join my team. He joined. Awesome. Whew. 
I will make you the same offer. Join my team. Yay! Two new team members. Let's go. And Heracross is our first one. Uh, let's see. Okay. And we'll take that too. Hold on. That's what I wanted to see. You can evolve. Turns out our Shinx can too, which is good. So you have become Roselia. Yay! Okay, and let's go ahead and evolve Shinx. Boom! Luxio! Okay, let's go ahead and swap this Badoo up to here. Let's uh, check summary on you. And let's see, not check summary, back. Uh, change moves. There we go, what do you have? Thunder Wave? That doesn't do any damage. I don't really want to, no. Yep, I'm sure, okay. Uh, do, 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 do. And let's run through here. Is that an alpha mammoth? Oh. 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 Well. Well. That is what it is, isn't it? Hmm. Hey, we got the Hoppo Berries! Nice! Oh, Shelter and Chad, if anybody wants it. Okay, so now we gotta find our way back up. I gotta make the climb again. Woe is me. Oh, I have to go through the cave again. That is a woe is me. I mean, I suppose at least there's torches this time. See if I can remember the path he told me. I mean, I've kind of got a marker, so that helps. At least there's that, you know? Shelter escaped. Oh, a gibble. Ooh, this is not where I need to be. Okay. This was the wrong way. Okay, hold on. I think it's just up here. 
on the left. Yeah, there we go. Alright, we made it back up top. Okay, let's see. We need to go this way. Um, why to jump? Let's get this little flame. 19 remain in this area. Cool, cool. Uh, I tried. Okay. Maybe I didn't try hard enough, but I did try. Um, let's see here. Throw that there. And then go here. Also pick up this. Oh, that's gonna be a fight. With a bronzor? What? Ooh. Oh, that's a problem. Okay, let's bring out Tyrosian. Okay. Um. He is level 31. He is level 35. Uh, so let's start with the level 31. It's a more guaranteed thing. Um, let's go ahead and do the Infernal Parade. Probably should have done... Never mind. Didn't need to do it strong style. Okay. And then for you, we're going to go ahead and do a Flamethrower. Cool. All right. Nice. Um, let's see here. Hold on. I think those are mushrooms of some kind. Let's go in my bag here. Um, let's grab a revive for Badoo so that I can continue to use that Badoo and build its happiness. Okay. And that one goes there. And then go there. And then grab that. Uh, keep going. Grab this. Okay. think I got everything. So let's keep going. Wait, where are we supposed to go? Oh, that way. Oops. Okay. That's my bad. Soot foot. Let's go. Hey, Fint. How's it going? What's the big idea, putting all the torches I spent ages tidying away? Do you get some sort of amusement, stomping around, ruining people's noble deeds? Oh, rendering a cave impassable to people who venture inside hardly seems noble to me. I'm doing pretty good, Finn. Um, let's see. Hmm. Well... That just goes to show that even we wardens don't always see eye to eye. I extinguish those uh, lights for the sake of the Pokemon in the cave who prefer the dark. Uh, I'm doing pretty good, just uh, 
progressing through the story here on uh, Pokemon Arceus. Um, we have beaten Arcanine, uh, and now we are working to get our uh, Sneasler, I think it's called, so that we can go and fight uh, Electrode. I extinguished those lights for the si Yeah, I read that already. But now, you louts, have put off my have put my efforts to waste. If you think I'll just let you sa saunter ahead to meet Lord Electrode, you're sorely mistaken. The only way you're getting past me is if you defeat my partner Pokemon. Let me at it. I'll beat him. Wait, him? That's a dude? Oops. Uh. Go, Skuntank. Show these louts the true meaning of silent but deadly. Okay. I should have put a ground move on... Why? What? No, not Badoo. No, not Badoo. Do. Yeah, I'm trying to decide what we're going to be doing next time. Um, let's see. I don't want to do the same thing. I'd rather keep it uh, full of variety, you know? Um, so I'm just not sure what we're going to be doing. I've been thinking about, like, um, Fallout. Uh, not Fallout, um, Fall Guys, um, as well as maybe Mario Kart. Thought about Mario Party, but you can only have four people in a game of Mario Party, so probably not that one. Um, let's see here, do, do, do. we'll go ahead and we'll just do another flamethrower. Awesome. And your Skun Tank is defeated. What did you expect? Listen here. Neither I nor Skuntank admit defeat just yet. Our challenge to you still stands. However, I will uh, withdraw to afford Skuntank time to recover. There's no shame in a tactical retreat. It's more of an advance, if you think about it. Mario Kart is a lot of fun. Keep your guard up. We'll be back. Hey, is that one of those um, uh, flame things we're supposed to do? What a lively character. I cannot fathom Miss War uh, Warden Melee's intentions, but for now, let's press on. That's my best pirate accent, and I think it's terrible. Oh, I can't get to that yet, can I? I'm going to need the mount that climbs walls first. I, oh, Fint, have you seen me play Mario Kart before? Were, were you here when, when I did the Plumpy Grand Prix? This is quite the ancient quarry. Or wait, this is the ancient quarry. The stones used to build the temple, temple atop this mountain, were all cut from this place. Whether by humans and Pokemon working as one, or by the labor of Pokemon alone, I cannot say. The stones that were left behind should serve to cover us from the gazes of wild Pokemon. Ah, there you are, Ingo. Oh, wait, that, that was supposed to be Volo, not Ingo. Oops. Um, Volo, was it? What is it? Uh, what is the matter, sir? I wanted to ask about that memory loss of yours. Have you considered that it could be could have somehow been caused by the space-time rift? I have no cause to think the rift is to blame, but then again, I hardly remember a thing, so it's difficult to say with certainty. 
I can't remember my own home, nor my family if I had any. So you might do better to pose your questions to Cal. I think it's to do with that rift. Indeed. Well, I do hope your memories return to uh, return, Warden I go. How about you then, Cal? Do you remember what you saw before you fell out of that rift? Was there anything inside? Mm, maybe something. Interesting. You see, personally, I suspect that whatever's on the other side of that rift is... Uh, causing, causing the strange lightning that plagues us. Um, I'm bad. <laughs> I came in last place, and I was beaten by a bot. Um, I was the only person that was below a bot in the final standings. Whatever's on the other side of that rift, yeah, okay. I've got the voice wrong for Volo, but I can't remember what voice I had for Volo. Indeed. I did some digging and found records indicating that the same space-time rift also appeared in Hisui in the distant past. That's why we always had... Uh, why we already had a name for it, as it appeared, in fact. Now, what kind of world do you suppose stretches out on the other side of the rift? My guess is, it's the almighty Sinnoh's realm. But then, that begs the question. Why is the space-time rift reopened when it closed once so long ago? And why would Cal have fallen through to us? There's just so much we don't know. I her fervently hope you unravel this mystery, Volo. I'm sure it would ease people's fears over the frenzies of our nobles. And while you investigate, sir, I'll continue to prioritize the safety of the people living in this world. Oh, I am a mere admirer of ruins and little more. If something needs investigating, then I would entrust that task to Cal. Until next time, then. Yeah, you're useless. Once through here, it will be just a little further. Let us move uh, move with speed, but not haste. Okay, so... Here's the thing. There's a gossifler in chat. Let's go ahead and see if I can get that. Um, I want to go with exclamation mark, poke ball, um, let's see, poke shop, great ball, maybe? I'm trying to remember what level Gossiflair is. Like, uh, what, what tier? I think it's second tier Pokemon. Like, like, uh, second form. Not a basic, but the, the next one up. Um, yeah. Okay. But, um, yeah, so here's the problem, of course. I really don't want to proceed much further because it is 7.52. And, of course, I end, uh, my normal end time is in eight minutes. Um, so what we're going to do then is um, I'm going to go ahead and save the game as soon as I remember how. Okay. Save it again to be safe. Um, and we're going to start by going over our Pokemon of the day. So let me just uh, pull that up real quick like. It's Fletchinder! Um... I'm surprised Vint didn't guess it. Hey, congrats, Vint. We got the Gossifler. Um, uh, I don't know if you didn't notice that it hadn't been guessed yet or if you didn't know, but it, it, it's Fletchender. Um, introduced in Gen uh, 6, according to the Scarlet Pokedex, Fletchender scatters embers in tall grass where bug Pokemon might be hiding and, uh, and then catches them as they come leaping out. 
and according to the Violet Pokedex, its territory has a radius of just over one mile. If any bird should enter it, uh, should enter, it will show them no mercy. There you go. There's our Pokemon of the day. Um, now I need to consult and see who's open for rating. Um, okay. Let's go for Golden Toast, yeah? Um, yeah, let, 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 let's go ahead and raid over to Golden Co Toast. Uh, Golden Toast is playing uh, Doki Doki Literature Club, which is a fantastic game. Um, you knew the Pokemon, but you didn't know the name. Yeah, yeah, I get that. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, let's see. I want, uh, Golden Toast 1... Where to go? Four, five. Okay. So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, head and head on over there. I want to thank you guys very much for watching, and I hope that all of you have a fantastic rest of your night. Oh wait, wait. Th th there's a waiting time. Also, uh, I, I should go ahead and do. Uh, uh, we should have a our raid thing. Uh, Kobold raid is our raid call. All right, guys. I'll see you over there.